Hey guys, it's Lucy here and Kelly and welcome to another episode of Life is Sweet. My hair looks so flat. Anyway, we had all intentions of carrying on Vlogmas when we got to the UK. However, as we hadn't seen our family in so long, we kind of got busy just spending time with them and yep. we didn't want to have a camera in front of their faces every two seconds so we never really reached for the camera so we do apologise. We haven't really got a Vlogmas UK edition. Part three, whatever we were yes. up to. <laughs> but we decided that because we're not quite ready to get let go of Christmas just mm -hmm. yet, that we were going to do a little video to show you guys what we got for Christmas. So just a little bit of goodies. Fun. Yes. Yeah. So we hope you guys enjoy it. So first on our little Christmas list is what the things we got each other. And I'm currently wearing mine. Kelly says, books turn muggles, muggles into, into wizards. Cause and they then do. mine says, Books, messy buns, and pumpkin spice lattes. And these tops, jumpers, sweaters are from Human Clothing, um, which you can find on our blog because we've done a few things on them because we love their stuff. Like we actually so had these sweaters, jumpers for I want to say it's been like three months now, sat in our we cupboard. Told but because we always guess what each other's got us, or we always end up telling each other, we made it like a pact that we even though we knew them. what they were. We weren't allowed to wear them. Yes, so, so we're very excited and they're super cozy. I have another one. Lucy got me two. I'm so lucky. So I got this one because anything Harry Potter related is a must. So and they have quite a few of the Harry they Potter. They have, so ones. you must check them out. They have an awesome yes, range. We'll of put the link quotes. below to their website. Um but then you got me another one that says, um, oh, my weekend's all, all booked, booked up. up and it's got the um stack of, stack books. of books and I love that it. That is how we roll. <laughs> cozy jumpers and book related and Harry Potter related things. So, I can't what wait more to wear could you want? This. It's so cute. Yay! Sticking with clothing items, my husband is absolutely awesome and he is he the best. And he spoils me rotten, I must say. Um, I am very lucky, bless him. And this year he put in my stocking a brand new outfit for the gym. Very colourful. So these are from Victoria's Secret and they are gorgeous. These are just pants and then the sports bra. I'm hanging it up weird so it goes like this. Um, <laughs> but I absolutely can't wait to wear it for the gym because, yeah, I just absolutely adore it. And I'm going to be very, very colourful. And yeah, I can't remember, he got me this one because he said, was it sprinkles? He said it reminds me. Oh, oh. Did he I say don't sprinkles? Know. I have to double check. He said something to do maybe that it reminded him of me. So yeah, I can't wait to wear it at the gym. Next one isn't so much a Christmas gift because I got it before Christmas. However, it's a must mention and you will see why because you ladies and gentlemen, coming. it is... Ta da! <laughs> it was waiting for me upon my arrival to England, like just sat in the corner of my bedroom, and it is the best ever. And me and my little sister keep saying to ourselves that it's so sad because Christmas is over, and you're like, but now I, I can't listen to it away. Yeah, because now we feel like now I have to wait to a whole year to listen to it, so we may sneak in another quick listen before like Christmas is true. Or because well. we have to say, like, guys, we are ones, aren't we, for the oldies, yes, the yes. old Christmas songs. Like people come out with new Christmas songs, and we're like, no, put a bit of Wham on, and like the original you know, Mariah Shaking Carey songs Seasons. and stuff. But the Overtones have done their original good old fashioned Christmas and this Christmas, two original songs. I know, but good old fashioned and, Christmas yeah, and this Christmas, I know, is our favorite. <laughs> It's my favourite but then. <laughs> what we're saying is the two new ones are originals and they are awesome. Even my husband when we were listening to it on the way to Virginia Long. because I made him listen to it loads. Um, he said, oh, like for two new songs they've done really good because they feel like catchy Christmas songs that they don't feel like it's... Over and over again in years so if you haven't listened to them this Christmas, I told you in the last video or the first video of December oh, to go and listen to it, to it. Quick, so you now. should have already done it because it is awesome. So we may actually finish filming this and then go dance <laughs> around the kitchen just one Get more time before next Christmas because the overtones were awesome and we had a very good old fashioned Christmas. Definitely a winning album. <laughs> okay. Yes, we did. So we have mentioned Rebecca Raisin countless times on here and our blog and we were super excited to get home. You probably already know yep. because the gingerbread cafe series that she had on Kindle was all of a sudden available in paperback. Yeah. <laughs> so we were so excited to get home and um, see this book on the shelves yes. and be able to hold it and feel it and hug it. Yes. And our little sister and our mum had bought it, which it With came also, which was pretty awesome because when we found it on the computer, it came as a two pack most places, like I'm sure you can get it separately, but most places with Jenny Oliver, The Little Christmas Kitchen. And I read this one a while back too and I absolutely loved it. So how perfect could you <laughs> get? It was like Rebecca Raisin, Jenny Oliver. So these were wrapped up under our tree yes. and we squealed with glee. Yes. So the note said, to Lucy, just something pretty to look at. Love, Jen. 
And I can't remember what my note said, but I'm pretty sure it was something along the same lines because she kept going on for ages about the fact that she had us a small present, but it was like the best present ever. And yeah. people, I'm not gonna deny that because she it's was right. Damn awesome. Our little sister wrapped up just very, very simply, but we love her for it because they are awesome and we love them. Ready? Dun dun dun! Like Captain America slash Chris Evans Christmas mug. Well, it's not really. Christmas Who would mug. not want to? Well, I don't know. Who would not want a mug like this? Yes. <laughs> it's like it's because we're we're always goofy because even though we're not really like read the comic book, we're well, not read the comic books, and but we love the movies. But so so when you see Captain America stuff, it's really cool. But it's even better, people, because it's when it's Chris Evans. So it's like you get Captain America stuff. It's better when it's Chris Evans. So yeah, she got us each a Captain America mug. Mine's downstairs because I'm using it's it. It's awesome. And and it kind of matches. Mine's currently just sat on my shelf in my bedroom, which matches the giant. And if you don't go on our blog, go and see. I'm oh, going to have to remember. Awesome. I'm going to put a link below to the blog where I mention this. Oh, it Dad's. was our dad blog. Yes. Because our dad went to a car show. And we love going to car shows with him because we like all the stalls and the 50s mm -hmm. stuff. Oh, our dad went to a car show a few months, months back, back and he came back with the best, Huge. giant, humongous Captain America, like similar canvas. to this picture, canvas, okay? And our little sister, it was for all our little sister, but she didn't have any space for it in her room, so it is currently in my room <laughs> above my bed. I'm not complaining, people. It looks awesome. So, yes, Captain America, anything to do with Chris Evans, we love. So this was like the perfect present from our little sister. So thank you, and, yeah, I love it. So I have the absolute best, sweetest, and most thoughtful friends in the world. And this present actually came from um, my first ever job working in a nursery. I had a little girl that was in my group, and nine years later, I want to say, she was I am still yeah. talking to her and um, writing letters when I'm in America. I write letters to her here, and her mum is the sweetest, most gorgeous, wonderful yep. woman in the world. And, you know, we keep in contact, and she always sends parcels, and, you know, vice versa, and it's just lovely. Well, lo and behold, this Christmas, when we were doing, like, our Christmas gifts, I just have to say that I was incredibly touched, and... I yeah. squealed <laughs> opening just about every single thing in this box in front of me. Ready? Can so, you see the box? Yeah, you can't see the box just yet. It'll cover my face. Ah! Her, she literally she had up actually been to explain. Venice with her mum, and everything in this box her, is from Venice. It came from Venice. And if this isn't the most prettiest Pandora. Um, Pandora box that you have ever seen. You know how excited we get over Pandora. I know, we told you, and it's so cute. I think I'm just it's gonna... It's chocolate and cream. I'm gonna eat what's inside, because it's chocolate and cream, so that's gonna be amazing. But I think I just wanna keep the box on show, because it is pink and it is beautiful. And then just to go for a little thing, like, this was amazing, because we go to Nana and Grandad's and watch the adverts of these Nutella Italian bread Italian breakfast TV. things and we've always gone oh my gosh we have Ooh. to find that here and you know things are starting to come to the States and England we thought we must find them but we've not been able to find them anywhere so when I opened this I about like <laughs> scream ah. everybody would have been able to hear it um, so these are delicious and they are just awesome and then just one of our favourites Bargy you know that's our favourite and then this again I had to squeal because we had these when we went to Padova ah. near Venice to see our Auntie Josephine and she had them and we just kept munching on them for the whole entire what trip we were there ones? and so they're our favorite and she These that's are actually christmas trees so and amazing. stars yeah. so shelly and family thank you so 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 much because i was just completely like blown, blown away. away and very very giddy and excited so thank you that was just the sweetest gift in the world okay last but not least we got these lovely gorgeous so so pretty necklaces right, from our auntie up. if we can show you zoom in mine is a moon oh, is it gonna zoom? Not zoom, it's zooming in on my face <laughs> hide my face hide face and there you go so i got a moon lucy lift yours up where are you going okay Ooh. and lucy got a star because the um just behind it our auntie said or our little sister said was I love you to the moon and back. So I got the moon and then and the stars yes, around it. And the stars around the moon at night time. So it kind of it was so so cute and I just thought it was lovely. So these I are got from to... Victoria Highfield Jewelers. Yes, I've just yes. I've been wearing this non-stop since Christmas. So thank you very much to our auntie. It is gorgeous and we love the meanings behind them too. Yes, that's the most special thing because as much as we love showing you all, I'm not going to do that because I can't actually get it on, <laughs> as much as we love showing you all the cute little things we got for Christmas, which are the sweetest, most thoughtful mm -hmm. things, um, obviously Christmas, the best thing about Christmas for us personally is just being with our family and, this year, yeah, and this year was yeah. very special for us because 
This is the first Christmas in two years that me and Lucy have actually been together on Christmas Day because last Christmas was wonderful, I was in Virginia and Lucy was here and the Christmas before that Lucy was in Virginia and I was in England so yeah. this Christmas we had all of our family around the, the table, our here. husbands and our nana and granddad and every year we had them around the table is just and so much very, so very special and, and yes we are so blessed to just be all together that's the most important thing i can't stress that enough so we had a wonderful christmas and we hope you all did too yeah. um getting ready for 2016 and we hope you all follow us into it and have a wonderful new year so until next time keep dreaming big keep smiling and we'll see you next time and also guys just a quick oh. add-on <laughs> we, we thought we were going oh well, please comment sorry. below and let us know your favorite moments yeah. memories little gifts and treats that you got for christmas um yeah comment below tweet us subscribe follow us on social media and we look forward to hearing from you and because we didn't film oh, yes, vlogmas and because we probably told you a zillion times that our favorite christmas tree ever is the one that we have downstairs. here in england downstairs um we thought we'd show you so stay tuned for our little sneak peek of our christmas tree Yay. bye guys <laughs>